there's nothing better than just having a nice puree of butternut squash or sweet potato to accent a dish or even just to have as a side. Well, they basically involve the same steps. Hey guys, thanks for joining us. If this is your first time tuning in, let us know you're out there by giving us a big thumbs up below and then hit that subscribe button to make sure you never miss a video. Now, let's start cooking. We've got pretty much three ingredients. We've got the, the sweet potato or butternut squash. I've just got it cubed here. I've got a sprig of tarragon. I've got a little butter. And of course, we have a little bit of salt. And literally, all we're going to do is pour, put those into a pot. And we're just gonna put about half the butter. I'm putting about a tablespoon of butter in there. And we're gonna fill it with water. Or actually, we're gonna put water to just cover the, the squash or the potatoes. And we don't, want to, we don't want to put too much. And we'll put that on the stove and add just a little bit of salt to that. I probably put a teaspoon of salt. We're going to bring it to the boil. And once it boils, we will turn it down and let it simmer, simmer up about a medium simmer, because we do want this to simmer until it's very, very, very soft. And then we'll go to our next step. Our squash has uh, softened, and as you can see, much of the water is gone. So now what we'll do is we're going to put all of the solid squash into the blender and if we if it's necessary to put a little bit more liquid we we've got the water we've got a little bit left in the pot we, which we can add to that but now let's just blend it and you want to let this go because we want to get it very very smooth so don't be afraid to go ahead and put it on high and let it go for a couple of minutes okay we let that blender go for a, a good minute minute and a half and which should be nice and pureed by now oh yes you see that 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 is the consistency we're going for and let's just give it a little bit of a taste it's absolutely perfect doesn't need anything, doesn't need any butter, doesn't need any salt. It is ready to go. So let's get it plated up. And that's how easy it is to make a puree of butternut squash or sweet potato. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more, give us a thumbs up below and hit that subscribe button, it's free. And ring the bell if you wanna be notified as soon as we release a new video. Also, let us know in the comments if you have any special recipe requests. We really appreciate you tuning in. See you next time.